this is Chase from CNC Loom Boys, and today I'm here to show you how to make Toadette. But next time I am not going to show you how to make the backpack, because I realized I might want to show you that after I make the Captain Toad, which I will make in my near future, it's definitely going to be this year, because the backpack is in the advanced level, it's very advanced, and... One, we are going to get on to what we need and the tools for to make this cute little toadette. First of all, this is actually Captain Toadette from Captain Toad Treasure Check. And first, you need your alpha loom, alpha loom hook, and a metal hook if you need. But you really need this in tight spots. You definitely need this. You're going to need five C clips and clear bands, red bands, all these five of them, lots of tan bands, two white bands, two yellow bands, a few black, and a lot of pink and some gray. A lot of tan. Mostly a lot of tan. Definitely a lot of tan. Definitely a lot of tan. And next, we are going to get started on our beloved Toadette's legs, which will take only a short time. And first, we are going to grab tan band. Grab it like this. See right here. As here, it's hard to show it to you because it's my fingers. My fingers. Then you twist it, and then put that so other side that's twisted that's not on the pin on the same pin that the other side that twisted is on. So it should look like this on the side and this on the top. And here first, we're going to. Take this, go in like that, then we are going to hold this right there, and then we are going to twist that, and twist and pull the side that's not on the, the pin, on the pin right across from it. Which will do. Which should look like this. What's this thing? And then you're going to do right here also. And then you're also gonna then you're gonna skip one right here and then do it right here. Here as well. And now you're going to need your red bands. But first, you're going to put your clear bands on. First, you put your thing right there, like the tan band, you put it back on. You put the clear band on. But you don't do it, you do it two pins, but then you don't let go, and you do it another one. Then you let go. Do that same thing for the other one. You're only going to be doing this one row, if you're asking. And then we can use our four, four of our red and put them on top of right next to the clear bands. So it should look like this. The red here, the tan here, the clear here, and the tan 
the bottom, which is twisted. Okay. Then we should loop, loop over the clear, which should be no problem. And we are going to loop over the tan now with our alpha look. Down the legs, actually. The legs are fast. I mean, yeah, so you can get some. And now we're going to start our arms and the body. First, we're going to do the same thing we did with these two on the sides. First, we're going to put cat band, then we're going to twist it to the other side. Don't push it down. Do not push it down. This will make it weird. And then you just do tip for the rest. Oh, and do the same thing here for the middle too. Push any of them down. It will just make it messed up. Push it down. And now we are going to get it clear, but only put it in the five mil. Then just do tan for the rest. No twisties. You're going to loop over the clear, then we loop over tan. Push it down. And next we are going to use forever black. And First, we are going to put one clear here, and we are also going to need one of our yellow, and two of our tan. Which first, we are going to put one yellow in the middle, first do it the clear 5 and one technique, and then we just put two blacks on the outsides. And then you do the same thing with the other side. Should look like this. If you're wondering what the black, yellow, and black, black are, that's Captain Toadette's belt. And then just arms. The arms are always going to stay tan. They will never change. Never. And then you're going to clear and loop over the tan. And then it seems like you don't. 
just do a row full of tan. First, middle, five, middle, here, and then. Should be able to pull out the legs. Then you are now we are going to start on the tie, which is actually a little cute. First, we are going to grab a red band. First layer across. I'm going to grab two red bands and this one. And the rest is we are going to put one here next to the middle one and then the one here. They're one apart and they're directly right here. And then damper the rest. You're almost done the body. That means we're almost done the tie. And we're also getting close to being done the whole thing. Well at least halfway done. again. And then you are going to do clear in the five middle again. Then you are going to grab your red band and put it in the middle. And no more red bands are going to be used. And in the rest. Over the bottom stuff. And push it down, pull it down, then you take the tan, then you put 
put it in here. So we should look at that. Then we're going to do that with the other side of the arm. And then do that for the other arm. And then and there, pull the arm down. Definitely pull the arm And now we are going to get our black. And first, clear by the middle, because there's actually nothing on the outside of the five middle now, because there's no arms. First, black, and take the rest. We are going to start the ponytail at the eye. Now that we are on the face, we are down the mouth. Now, pull out the legs. You should be able to pull out the arms too, since they're long. Just do a roll with all the tail. And the next row we're going to get, we are going to start using our pink. And we definitely are going to start our pink in the next row. We definitely are. We're going to need two pink for the next two rows. Then we're going to need pink. down. And now we are going to start the ponytail. Remove our pink. And like them right here, we are going to twist it, but not twist it like cat band. We're just going to twist it regularly. So it should look like this. And we are going to use our all just five Middle clear, but this time we're going are going to do our eyes. So first we put black band here and black band here. So there's three spaces left for tan. And bye bye back. And almost bye bye tan. And blue. And then the tan is. You're only going to need five more tan left after this row. Should be almost done. Just have to finish this. Then we loop over the clear and loop over the tan. And the other side. Push it down. Pull it from the bottom again. This is the way I get it all stretched out nice. And next, this is going to be a uh, five middle clear right here. Then two pink. 
things on the outside. And then tan for the rest. Then loop over clear. And loop over earth. And now we just gotta say bye bye tan. And push it down. And put it from the bottom. Now we say bye bye tan. By putting away, and do I have a bag? Oh. left. One of them only has one name left of to do. And next we are going to just do all pink I guess for the next two rows. Like all pink. Just going to just all clear across. Then just all pink for the row. No twisties, no loopies, no anything. Just basic. This is the basic Push it down. Put the arms also. And then use it clear across again. And then I'll paint it. Next row, we're definitely going to start using it. Definitely going to start using it. Because we only need nine. We need eight. details now since they're a little peeking out there and next you're going to start using the gray first across use we are also going to start using the white the first clear across then two whites on the sides that's actually all the white we need so white away and bye bye white even though you were only there for one second. Okay. And then paints right next to the white. Like this. So it's coming up. Then paint for the rest. And then loop over clear. And we are getting close to being done on this fabulous toad. Keep this pattern, the toad pattern in your head. Because I might be doing Captain Toad soon. And then you pull the toad. 
And now we're going to be using the last yellow. And I got, we're going to use four more tan. Forgot all that. two clear bands left. And first you loop on the clear, then you loop on the bottom, then you loop on the other side of the bottom, then you push it down, then we use our paint again, push the user clear, go across, then we do pink, two inside pink. First we just do two pink on the sides. Like this. And then Speaking of pink, actually sneak peek is going to be pink. Speaking of sneak peek, we're only one row away. Let me see here. See, we are so close to being done. So, we're right clear. We go to the bottom stuff. We are like so close to being done. If you got this far, congratulations. Because this is a long tutorial. This took me a few days. And now, we'll open the bottom. And this is our last row. You're only going to need five pink left. And press the pink back. It's hard for me because the pink's the farthest one. And reverse. So you're only going to need five pink left, five C clips. And one clear. First, you're going, for this row, we're going to put the clear band, I mean, the pink band inside, like we did for the arms. We're going to pull it inside. So, like this on the side. And then clear for the five minute again. And then pink for every single pin. And we are definitely going to still be on the last row. Definitely last row. And loop over the clear. Loop over the bottom. down and we are on to C clip it. So first we're going to grab this then pull it to the other side. Do that with all of them. And so this on the side and this on the top. And then you're going to C clip it. Thank you. 
said you might want it. So you don't want your hands. And your toilet it looks super cute. It's a little ident or a little identical twin. He's super cute. Now they're gonna walk away in sunset or in the well lamplight, <laughs> whatever else they call it. And now it's time for our sneak peek. You all know the one who inhales Waddle Dee's Kirby. He's our cute little pink little cute little ball with shoes and eyes. He is cute and it does go with our toadettes here because they both like pink. And now they're going to walk out of here. And now I'm clearly saying for this tutorial, bye, see you next time.